When I was your age, yeah. and then you said you had a little drink, and like family parties, and probably about a little bit older than you, maybe. You ready to try some of this? This used to be my favourite drink. Ugh. Just, just a little drop. I'll have a bigger drop because obviously I'm no doubt here. Whatever you do, do not drink it straight because it's disgusting. And you'll get so drunk you won't know where you are. Well then, cheers my girl. Ready? Cheers me then. Look. <coughs> <laughs> what do you think? It's disgusting, isn't it? Do you like it? No. No, I'm not keen, but you, you used to do the trick when you were younger. What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? Give my girl her first drink. Why? What do you mean? What drink is what? You used to let me when I was her age. She were her age? Oh, I was a little bit older. But I'd rather her have a drink with me than be out doing something she shouldn't be doing. What? What are you talking about? It's not very kind, is it, eh? What are you doing? Hmm? What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? Nothing, just having a little chat with my girl. Are you serious? Huh? Are you joking? I would rather her have a drink with us. Or me, then her do it on the street like we used to. I, did, fact, not, I did not drink okay, on the street. Okay, but I'm pretty you sure you were doing worse to things. No, Jess, mate, what are you doing, babe? Are you sitting there all of you? Belle, stop drinking that. <laughs> what are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? They're having a drink. Ridiculous. I've just sat and blown up 200 balloons and I put them all the way through, but there's obstacles in the way. I will be red, Jess will be yellow. It is a race to pop all of the balloons. This room just needs some fairy up liquid spread on the floor. Ready? No. Three, no. What, can two, I yellow. Three, two, one, go. Is Nick's house. He's Stop. not here at the moment. So, oh, see, so this is his house, though. Oh, Where? Yeah. Okay, is he in? Because I need to see him. No, he's not here at the moment. It's quite important. Yeah, I don't know what this is. What are you flashing that around for? I'm, not, I'm returning this to Nick. Nick sent this to me. It's not mine, is it? I don't know who it is, to be fair. You've just bowled up. We've yeah. had a huge amount of problems over the last few years. I don't know who you are. You're getting all airy with me. Yeah, and because I've been sent. Where he is. He sent this to my neighbour and it's embarrassed me. Dan's here. Hey, can't just turn up at the house like that. Why not? Because he can't. I said he's more than welcome to come down. Don't know how he got a dress because. You need to stop inviting people. You're 
you're more than welcome to do this. You're more than welcome to do that. Mate, it ain't for normal. A lot. How we've, got would you feel, we've got our own problems. How would you feel if I just got married to you and then four weeks later, I was like, no, I don't want to marry you anymore, but we're already married. That, that. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Ah, yeah. <laughs> yes, mate. No. What are you doing here? I've written this all that. That's yours. It's not it's my name on it she's listen she's yours she's not obviously not mine she is you're holding her like I'm, she's yours well let me tell you something i've been on two london underground trains with this two mainline trains do you know how many people haven't you know, you obviously love her more than mate, I do, mate. I liked her so much. Yes. I there thought you she go. would do. You're welcome like to her, mate. Yours. Honestly. That's yours. It's embarrassing. How embarrassing that was. My neighbour delivered this to me. Answer me why my neighbour delivered that to me. Well, one of them nipples fell off on the train and rolled under someone's seat. I may have had an accident. How funny would it be? Chuck this one away. Put four of these in with the phone jar and make some numbing ice lollies for Jess. Seriously, wrong with this. Taste that. I'm all right. Taste it, Nick. Honestly, just... Mum. Oh, my mouth is. I can't. It's... I don't know. Mum. Hello. <laughs> God, no, no, no. What? Your lips funny. Do you really can't? How can he answer you? Why my lips funny? And yours not. <laughs> it's Bongella. Huh? It's Bongella. I made another one after you made yours. It's got I feel like my lips are getting bigger. Four, four, you little Botox there, isn't it? Huh? Four are they getting bigger? Four chews. Are they getting bigger, Nick Green? <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! It's not, honestly, my mouth is filled up with water. Nick, please, please, don't well, you've done it to me before. You've done it in my toothpaste. I haven't. You and Jack did. No, I didn't. Yes, that you was did. years ago. Don't talk about the past. Please help me out, Nick. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> now, I've always thought about having Botox. I've heard that it, like, lifts you up and makes you feel more confident and so much better in yourself. But I thought before I would actually get the Botox done, I don't know how Nick would feel about me getting it done. So I bought some fake stick-on lips. All you need is a bit of glue. So I've got my glue. I've got my lips. <laughs> right, let's stick a one and go and get his reaction. I'm scared. Nick? What? Why are you laughing? You're a fucking idiot. What do you mean? You're an idiot. I take it you don't like them? No, you look weird. Okay. No, baby. No? No. no. Well, I was thinking of having Botox done. No, I know, but I don't think that's the right thing. Once you start... You're forever doing it. Yeah, but I feel like it will just give me a little bit more confidence that I need. Maybe you're the most beautifulest person I, I know. Yeah, you know? okay, yeah, maybe, but I'm not. And also, I just feel like I've put on weight, so, like, I just feel like I need a little pick-me-up, you know? Yeah, but if you start doing that... Yeah. ...then you'll need to do that every I'll just have, months. like, a li little shot. No, baby, you have to do it for the rest of your life, and then your lips will get bigger and bigger and bigger. Yeah, but I've heard it gives you so much more confidence, and make you feel so much better. No, baby, you I'll take them off. Okay, well, that didn't really go to plan. Maybe I'll just have a little bit. Or none.